wanted to try to figure out a way to, to break through those equity gaps that have just been sitting there year after year after year. So the cultural curriculum audit is really a special program that we have at Long Beach City College. We really get the opportunity to dive really deep into our course curriculum, looking at all the different ways that we assess our students, the way that we have the curriculum formatted, looking at our outline of record, looking at the textbooks we use, how to be more inclusive in the coursework, and really just helping our students see themselves in the class. As a new faculty, as a Latina, you know, person of color, this was really empowering and impactful for me. I'm a first-gen student, the daughter of immigrants, and I was the first person to go to college. So I went to community college, and once I transferred, I really got lost in the system. When I looked at my faculty, I didn't see myself represented in my faculty. Um, I didn't see folks who looked like me, because I've never had a person of color as my educator. So I remember being in the audit, for the first audit that was created with Suman and I remember her speaking up and saying that she didn't see herself in the culture of the curriculum and I just remember thinking oh my goodness this woman is so inspiring so hearing Suman just really gave me the confidence to speak up and use my own voice to kind of champion for others who look like me or who identify with me or just see themselves in me whether it's my students or my colleagues and it's just amazing to see how much change has happened in really a short amount of time. I want to feel included and welcome when I enter the classroom. I want to feel like I'm being represented. I like to see something that's new and modern and that's relevant to the times. I think it'll help students uh, be a lot more successful. It'll give them more reasons to be engaged. It'll give them more reasons to want to participate. It'll help them want to actually learn, do further research into the topics that we're discussing. What really has allowed the cultural curriculum audit to occur has been the collaborative effort of not only our faculty who are really focused on finding a way to decrease that equity gap, but really the concerted connection and effort of the entire campus from our administration all the way to our faculty leadership. I think that's something, a byproduct of it we didn't expect. Almost every individual who's in a faculty leadership position on campus have been faculty members who've gone through the audit, which to me now signifies the real importance of equity, not just within the classroom, but really getting an opportunity to see it being infused throughout the campus in all these different faculty leadership roles. We really began to feel like our college truly started to care about equity and inclusion. And really, I think we started to feel like our voice mattered. The impact that it made on us as faculty of color um, has really allowed us to shine in a way that none of us had ever expected.